The Thunder winning streak hits three as an old familiar face showed up at Chesapeake Arena. I'm Barry Trammell along with Darnell Mayberry here on uh, Tuesday night where the Thunder took care of the Milwaukee Bucks 114-101. Darnell is not the old familiar face. Kevin Durant is his home debut this season. Durant was solid, very good. Uh, Russell Westbrook was spectacular, and uh, after a little bit of a rough start, it looked like old times. Yeah, I mean, they did get off to a slow start, but they bounced back nicely. Defense buckled down. They held them to 26 points or less in each of the last three quarters, held them to 40% shooting for the game. So I thought it was a real solid effort after that first quarter. A little bit of a rough defense. Bucks hit the Thunder for 31 in the first quarter. But the offense was good all night. Both Durant and Westbrook had seven assists each. Both of them shot well. I think Westbrook 8 of 16, Durant 7 of 11. So very good offense. Yeah, and then you guys we haven't mentioned, Reggie Jackson came off the bench with 18 points. Pretty efficient night. Serge Ibaka, perfect from the field, 5 of 5, 15 points. Um, you know, five rebounds. He had some really nice work inside defensively. So a uh, really good team effort tonight by the Thunder. And I think that's what you want to see as this team goes forward, uh, especially as the games start to get tougher and tougher now. You want to get nice team efforts from uh, and nice contributions from a lot of different guys. Now, I thought Durant was a little rusty early. He had uh, a stretch where he made three bad passes in about an 80-second span. F had ended up with four turnovers, all on bad passes. But his playmaking really improved the longer the game went. In the fourth quarter, he was really good di distributing the ball. Yeah, I thought it started in the third quarter. Something clicked for this team after halftime, especially Kevin Durant. He was really finding teammates, getting everyone involved. He was sacrificing his own offense a little bit to get other people wide open shots. And, uh, you know, he could have finished with even more assists if guys made more buckets tonight. But I thought he really played a nice game. He said that was one of the things he struggled with uh, in his first game back at New Orleans, his timing, his passing, uh, when to shoot, when the pass and get out others involved. I think he was fantastic with that tonight as the game went on. Let's go to the locker room, see what the guys had to say. No, we just we just want to keep playing, uh, playing the game that we're like we know we're capable of playing and, and do it consistently, uh, night in and night out. And I know we still have a lot of work to do. We still have a lot of uh, room to grow. Uh, we gotta we gotta. Um, we got we to gotta just keep getting better every day. There's a lot of basketball left. Um, we, we like what we did tonight on both ends. Uh, a lot of guys sacrificed. I mean, I'm just trying to fill the game out and not trying to worry about doing so much in so little time, I guess. And I just, you know, last few games, just go out there and play. And whatever happens, happens. So, uh, you know, I've, I've seen some opportunities where I was aggressive uh, and get to the paint and kicking out and somewhere I can get to the rim a little bit as well. So I'm just trying to find a a balance between the two and just find a little rhythm um, as well. It's great, real good, man. I just, uh, uh, just getting used to it, man. It's every week is, is better and better, and uh, I'm just taking one at a time. And you know, I'm not trying to break the rim, but I mean, I don't even think about it. just go out and play. And uh, you know, I know doctors did a great job. Rehab was great, so I'm, I'm confident. I think it was up and down throughout the game. We got to learn how to be a better home team from for 48 minutes. I thought we played in spurts. Um, and we kept letting them hang around. We had them up by like 15. We should have went on here and got them out the way. They'll cut the lead and we got to make plays and all that type of stuff. But overall, I feel like we're coming together real well. And now the Thunder awaits the Thursday night showdown with the Cleveland Cavaliers, LeBron James, Durant, LeBron in the same building. Going to be a lot of fun. Yeah, anytime those two take step on the floor together, that's the marquee matchup. But with this Cleveland Cavaliers team, you got Kyrie Irving versus Russell Westbrook. Kevin Love now a new addition with the Cavs versus Serge Ibaka. So it's going to be a lot of star power on the floor on Thursday night. It's going to be TNT is going to be in the building. Grant Hill is going to be doing the game. So it's going to be a really good game. I think a really good test for the Thunder, especially the defense, which has been inconsistent at times. Can they stop a high powered Cavs offense? We'll have it covered for you here on News OK and every day in the Oklahoma. <laughs>